Hello everyone, my name is Nathan, you're watching The Leviathan, and welcome to The Autumn Glen. I thought it was just Autumn Glen there for a second. Um, this is a free game on Game um, Jolt. Uh, not sure if it's a demo, but I, I'm pretty sure it's the full game, I'm not 100% sure. I didn't read the description on it, which I usually do, but I didn't for this one. It just looked interesting, I like the art style. So let's get into it and play it. Hopefully it runs well. Um, it's a game made on Unity, which uh, sometimes they don't run it as well on my computer as they should. But we shall see. Let us play. Uh, let's see. WSD the move. Control to crouch. F to interact. G to get your character through while hiding an object. While holding an object. Blah, blah, blah. Uh, this game contains strong language that may be inappropriate for children. You heard the, you heard the man, children. Okay. Uh, no, I don't want to censor the language. Uh, let's begin. Hmm. Interesting. I'm not quite sure what type of game this is at all. Not at all. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's first person though. But I'm not sure what happens in the game. Consumed by fire, never seen by the cool light of dawn, nor the cold darkness of dusk, hidden by the cover of thick woods and lush vegetation, void of any habitual, habitable nature, lies the town by the name of the Autumn Glen. This doesn't sound like a good town at all. Cool, whoa. That is a very sensitive mouse. Very sensitive. Okay, can I can I mess with the sensitivity here? Options. Nope, it didn't for these again. It might have froze my camera though. Uh, head bob amount, no, that seems to be good. Hmm, they don't have a setting for that. Wait, controls, it might be in controls. Nope. Oh, it looks sensitive. Wow, it's really low already. Um, let's turn that down a little bit because it's pretty sensitive. Okay, let's get into this. Kind of uh, has like a slow movement when I turn my head too. Uh, that's interesting. Okay, let's get into this though. This looks interesting. It seems to be running well, so we shall see. There's not a lot in the game yet, so it might start running worse once we get there. Ah, it's a gun! Give me gun! Uh, pickup is F, right? Yes. Um, Renote. Uh, what is that? Sylvan... Phil, Sylvanins? I can't read that. As my uh, but, uh, brother f feasts upon the very fundaments of my person, I feel as though I am forced to enter into an oblivion, to strike him down in his very do dormancy. I might do so before his... F um, Friend, uh, I can't even read this. Uh, appear does the equipment to my wait, what equivalent to myself? Okay, sorry, I'm having trouble reading this just because my screen is kind of blurry right now for some reason. I don't think the game's actually that way, I think it's just my screen right now. Stop uh, writing like a, a pretentious fool, okay. Interest. Whoa, 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 whoa. You do this, everything changes. Nicholas, who is Nicholas? Well, Nicholas, there's only one chance you got. You're gonna have to bow before me. Worship me, Nicholas. Worship me. No? I see you're a man of principles. Well, I am too. There you go, Nicholas. You earned this. You made me do it. I didn't want to kill poor Nicholas, but he made me. Okay, apparently we killed some dude named Nicholas, and now we're out ooh, camping. What a glorious day. Weird dream. I know, right? I always have bizarre dreams where I kill some random person named Nicholas. Um, broken axe head. Uh, can I pick it? Why, thank you. Broken axe handle. Wait, can I not actually keep these things? Oh, I can look around corners? Oh, that's interesting. This is a horror game. It might be a horror game. No idea. Ooh, what is this? Uh, torn note. Went to go buy an axe. Be back soon. What does that actually say? Did he just misspell back? Uh, I need to go find him. Hideous orange book. Huh! <laughs> Oh, I can't throw it? Oh, uh, there we go. Uh, you hideous orange book, I know what to do with you. 
<laughs> Goodbye. That's what you do with hideous objects. You just throw them in the sea. Ah, yeah, yeah. Um, Nicholas's football. So is Nicholas my brother? Nicholas's backpack. Ah, uh, stupid Nicholas's backpack. We'll just uh, whack, whack, whack. Uh, toss it over there. Um, blue lantern. Uh, uh, toss that. Toss. Uh, toss it over there. Okay. What is this though? Sports therapy pamphlet. Why are we, are we at a sports therapy camp? We'll help you recover with online guides, informational professionals, informative professionals, years of experience, knowledge with a variety of sports, training facilities. Why, thank you. Um, okay, wait, what's, what's that? <gasps> it's a key. Ooh, what do we need the key for? I got the key. And I'm going to know what to use it for eventually, but not right now. Ah, darn it, stay crouched. Uh, read second note. <clears throat> I, I still don't know what that is. Is that Silverns? Silverns? As the cool water laps the banks of the river, fire surrounds each pa passing crest of water, running down like bombs from the heavens. Brightly colored leaves plunge into the depths of the water, shining through the vi veil of... Tr wait. Through the uh, veil of... Tree, veil of trees, I guess. Bright orange and yellow colors flood now, flood the now withered forest. Okay, cool. You seem like one of those writers who, who likes to use big words for really no reason. The pines are dying. Are they now? Are they? Well, let us explore this world. Ooh, can we can we can we play uh this? Um, ah, I need to set down the key. Uh, stay there, Mr. Key. Don't go anywhere. Uh, 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 throw. Uh, throw. Ah, darn it. I need to be closer. Um, pick up. Okay, there we go. Uh, oh, come on. That's stupid. Okay. Pick this up. I wish we had an inventory so I didn't have to carry this around like this. Oh, Nicholas, where are you hiding? Um, ooh. Food. What is this? A door? Is that a door? What are you? I swear that is a door. Huh. Right. Come here, Key. I need you. Well, the music's interesting. It's kind of a little creepy at the same time. Of just being kind of kind of peaceful music, but also kind of creepy music at the same time. Where is everyone? There's like food and stuff here. Wait, what? What was that? I could interact with something. Was it just the food or something? Okay. Uh, what do you have to say, sign? No trespassing, sign. I'm not trespassing. I'll stay behind this fence, uh, unless I can unlock this with the key. Ah, gate. I need to go through this gate. I'd climb it, but I've got a bum knee. I need to find another way to get past. I should check the compass. Maybe the key I find in Nicholas's tent unlocks this. Okay. Check the compass. Do I have a comp? How does one use a compass? Where is the compass? Ah, darn it. Wait, where'd you go? Shit, where did the key go? Where'd, where'd it go? Ah, she is. Where'd it go? Ah, oh, no, man. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Did I see it? It better have gone back to the... Where it, where it started, because that just vanished. Nah. Nicholas, I blame you. What are you doing hiding the keys? Ah, oh, thank goodness. Huh, what would I do if it had vanished? I'd have to start over. Okay, so we have a compass, apparently. Uh, map. Uh, bop, 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 bop. Oh, zoom. Interesting. Ah, no, get back here, Mr. Key. You can't just go flying off like that. We got rules. 
Okay. Maybe the key will unlock this. How do I know, though? Okay, there we go. Thank you, Gate. Do I still need you, Mr. Key? You seem to be sticking around, so I will assume... So... Trash... No trespassing... I can't get past it. I was gonna go trespass, but apparently they don't want me to. Well, maybe I could've jumped over it. Apparently I got a bum knee, and it's so painful I can't climb this small little fence. If I remember correctly, it's a few miles to the nearest anywhere. I don't exactly feel like walking, but if I must, then I must, I guess. Uh, read sign. Palmyra River. Campground. Hmm, this is a very pretty forest. I do enjoy the art style of this game. Very nice. I like how the trees are all like blocky, like just round things. Um, shit, man, what direction is it? How am I supposed to know what direction to go? Um, start walking to anywhere, huh? Oh, okay. That was actually the do something. Okay, interesting. Interesting. Our story begins when a hero walks down a road. To find anywhere. Apparently this is anywhere. Is that just called anywhere because I'm a little kid and I don't know names of stuff? Apparently I'm a kind of disturbed little kid. I drew like a, a drawing of me killing my brother, I think? It's amazing how you can live somewhere your whole life. And there's always that small nook you, that um, you've yet to discover. It is crazy, isn't it? Ooh, what is this? A paper. Hay bale, six fifty. Pay inside. That is actually really cheap for a hay bale. Shit, man. Actually, I don't know what price the hay bale is. I'm assuming it's pretty cheap. Seems cheap for a hay bale. Are all these doors locked? Where is everybody? Sorry, we're closed. Is it because you're dead? Is that why it's closed? Is that where you've gone? All of you to your graves? Locked door? Ooh, pumpkins. Is this Halloween time? It's a pumpkin. Uh, uh, uh. Uh. I do like uh, how all the art is like this, just box, boxy type art with like the sharp corners. What? What? What are you? What? 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 What do you? Interesting, there seems to be stuff flying off into the distance. Read poster. The Oakwood High School Halloween Parade. Monday, October 25th. Starts at 5 p.m. <laughs> Don't be late. Okay, where to next? Ah, the theater. At least I assume this is a theater. Locked. Damn it. Damn you, man. The French douche. Starring Jules Mannen and uh, Chloe Gabrielle. <laughs> Terror on Main Street. Oh, the best movies. The best movies they have here. What is this? Forced of Agony. Starring Emily Eve. Nut Street. Oh, I want to watch that movie. Let us watch that movie. Oh, Papa, you want to watch the movie Nut Street? Oh, you cannot see that movie, my child. That is for grown-ups. What is this? Pears. One dollar and twenty-five cents a pound. That's, uh, I guess, reasonable. Reasonable. Apples. One twenty-five a pound. I haven't actually bought apples in a while. The things that I actually was surprised how cheap they are is habaneros. I think I bought like seven for like a dollar or something. That was cheap. That was cheap. Locked. It's locked. More pumpkins. Am I going to be that evil child who smashes pumpkins? Is there someone down there? There's someone blue hiding down there. But we wait, mister. Don't go anywhere. I have not finished searching. Oh, I forgot you can peek around corners. Not really well. I feel like a lot of games that give you that ability peek around corners don't do enough of a lean so you're not really you're still out in the open when you peek around the corner so it doesn't really help ah old papers pizza oh old pop it 
Pepe's Pepe's Pizza. Today's special entrees. Do do do. Let's hit read because that's a little difficult. Entrees: Pepe's Sweet Fruit Pizza, thirteen dollars and fifty cents. The sweet fourteen-inch fruit pizza with a cookie dough crust, cream cheese center, and strawberry orange slice toppings is always perfect to eat. That sounds delicious. I've never really liked the sweet um, 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 dessert pizzas myself, but that does sound quite delicious. Appetizers: old cheese drown, uh, wait, uh, drown French fries. Uh, Five dollars and fifty cents. Chow down on our original cheese covered French fries. That sounds delicious. I would love to eat here, but it appears you guys are all out and about. Let's see more of that. Another thing of that. This is well made. Very well made. It's it is kind of um, ominous that there is nobody here though. Nobody here at all. The music kind of keeps it from getting too ominous. If there was like no music or a different style of music, it'd be very ominous. Cooper's Coffee. It's a black as midnight on a moonless night. Closed today. That is a very strange uh, motto, my friend. Doesn't quite spill off the tongue. Closed today for event. Oh, it's the holiday event. It's Halloween, is it not? That's why there's pumpkins everywhere. Oh my. Are we going to go to the Halloween parade? Ah, sounds delightful, but there's nobody here to enjoy a parade. That is very ominous. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. That is kind of ominous. The tree shadow is moving. Is that noise not in here or out, out, outside in real life? I have to imagine that's outside. Kind of sounds like a lawnmower. So I'm going to assume that it's somebody mowing the lawn down the street from me. Or outside of my house. Uh, sir? Holy shit, he's moving. Um, oh, no. I don't know if I want to deal with this right now. Mr. Blue Man? What? What is that? What, 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 what is that? It's vanished. What did you throw on the ground there, guy? Talked to guy. Can, any chance I could get through? Um, yeah, sorry. I can't let anyone through because, like, I can't. Uh, why not? My boss has a st uh, stick up his ass about these things. Uh, you, you sure you can't let me pass? Sorry, I'd like to help, but yeah, I, yeah, help you out. But my boss would kill me. Is that like a literal kill you? Because that seems like like what this town is kind of like. Okay, well, have at least uh, have you at least seen my brother? What does he look like? Uh, I don't remember. <laughs> uh, I don't remember. You don't know what your bro own brother looks like. <laughs> Good story, dude. Crap! Why can't I remember? Uh, have you at least uh, met someone named Nicholas? I can't remember. Sorry, man. I haven't met met of wait. I haven't met of anyone named. Okay, that's weirdly written. Anyone named Nicholas? How have you not met anyone named Nicholas? I feel like everyone's met somebody named Nicholas. Sorry, I couldn't help you, man. Maybe you can go see if that old geezer down the street knows your pal. Old geezer? I didn't see no old geezer. You better not stalk me. You never better not be following me, blue man. I got my eye on you. What you do with my brother? Oh, look, it's the old geezer. Hello, Mr. Purple Geezer Man. Oh my goodness, you are so old and geezer looking when you are purple. Oh my, have you seen my brother, old geezer? Any chance you've seen my brother? I've been waiting for you, Mr. Sullivan. Yeah, that was a terrible old voice. Uh, why have you been waiting for me? I haven't been waiting for you specifically, but someone like you. Uh, what do you want with me? 
It's not what I want with you. It's what you want with me. You're someone who comes wandering along into a town no one searches for to find a solution to your individual problem. I see. Okay, have you seen my brother? Oh, you really don't remember, do you? You murdered him like last summer. Remember what? Try remembering the last time you saw your brother. Uh, was that the time I shot him in the face? Do 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 do. This is really well made. It's interesting. It's it's kind of a little slow paced and stuff, but but it's interesting. I like it. <gasps> oh no. Can I use the pillow to smother him in his sleep? Why is why is there a no knife in there? My father's knife. Oh no. Someone knocks at the door. I need the knife. I need it. Okay. I turn off the lights. They give me the shadow. They give me darkness. Cover my darkest deeds. Hello, brother. You come out of the woods. We live in the woods. This is very odd, brother. Hey, Nicholas. Where the hell have you been? Nowhere. Sure. I know where you've been. Why Why does it matter to you where I've been? It matters a lot because you're my brother. That's irrelevant. Why do you show up then? To see my asshole of a brother for apparently no reason. What's your problem? Hmm. We need to get this issue between us sorted out. There's no issue. Obviously, that's not true. You have an issue with me, and I have an issue with you. I just know that. For starters, where have you been? I like... Uh, like I said, it's nowhere. Are you seriously playing that card again? I don't know what else to tell you. The truth would be nice. I, I honestly don't know the truth. I just woke up here. You're lying. It's as close to the truth as I know, you fucking prick. Where have you been? Where have you been or I'll use this our father's knife on you? I told you, I don't know. Okay. So you believe me? I don't have a choice. But I don't really believe him. We'll just... Stab him in the back while he comes in. Uh, time to use the old knife on him. I have a feeling we killed Sir Nicholas. For some bizarre reason that I don't know. Talk to the old geezer. Hmm. By that look on your face, it seems as though you remember. Are you remembering? Keep going. I'm lost. What am I looking for? I don't know, but you'll know when you find it. Cranberries. We're all out of them, and that is what I am looking for. You, my son, are probably looking for your brother, I would assume. See that you ask me where he went. Ah, a tower. Interesting. I don't know why this reminded me randomly just now of uh, Firewatch. It might just be the art style is different for sure, but it just might be the similar colors. I don't know. I just was thinking of Firewatch and I was like, this doesn't actually isn't actually at all like Firewatch, but for some reason, I feel like it is like that. Um, why did the screen do that? Oh, Nicholas, where are you hiding, Nicholas? We're, we got some things to settle. Brother to brother. Mano a mano. Uh, where'd the Nicholas go? Okay. Where's the next clue? I have a feeling we're trying to get to the tower. It's the... Kind of the tallest thing in the area. The only real thing of a jig. Let's sprint off this direction. I am glad that this game is is, is playing smoothly. Hmm. 
confusing. Very confusing. What does one do when they are confused? I don't know. Did I miss something very obvious? Oh, what is this? Is this what I missed that was very obvious? A cut down tree, huh? Who cut it down and why? Was I supposed to go into the water? No, apparently not. Because what, we were facing the tower. There doesn't seem to be a way to get up to the tower. Uh, I want up, man. Yeah, man, let me up. Jeez, dude. The, I didn't see anything out here that would help me. I'm getting like some really annoying glare from outside. What is that? What? What the heck? What are you? It's a perfectly little round bubble thing. Interesting. Did I miss something? What did I miss, man? You gotta tell me. You, you gotta show me what I missed, man. Hmm. Interesting. What am I missing? What am I missing? What am I missing? Do, 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 do. There's a lot of weird stuff on the ground, but none of this stuff can I that I can interact with. Okay, hold on a second. I'm gonna shut my um, curtains so I just get this glare off my screen so I can actually see stuff. Okay, they are much better. I can actually kind of see the screen now. Okay. Okay. Is there something across there that I can get to? Did I put these on backwards? Nope, they're on, they're on right. They just fell on backwards. Okay, okay, come on. What am I missing here? Like when I run, I... Uh, his vision bobbles a little too much for me to actually see what I'm looking for. Hopefully it's not something very obvious, but I haven't seen anything to interact with. Okay, the fence definitely seems to be solid, so I don't think I'm trying to get to the water tower. Yeah, and there's, there's a campground. Oh, wait, that's where we woke up. Am I just supposed to look out over there? Oh, it's Nicholas. Yell at Nicholas, okay. Hey, yo, asshole, Nicholas, over here. Yell again. Nicholas, is that you? Are you asleep? Come on, Nicholas. Wake up, Nicholas. Did we even check there? I'm pretty sure he wasn't there before. Hmm. The asshole's asleep and he won't talk to me. Or the, or he won't talk to me. This is futile, of course. Okay, I feel like that was what I was... missing. It kind of directed me there before. Like the, I'm, I think the camera kind of directed me there, but I didn't notice it. Hey! Mr. Blue Man! What are you doing to here, guy? What are, you, what are you doing here? I'd like to tell you, but my boss would be very, be very happy. Wouldn't be very happy. Who's your boss? What boss? I don't have any boss guy. You said your boss wouldn't be happy. Really? I ain't able to recall having a boss. Do you know how I got here? Why would I know? Do I look like a, a wait, a psychic? Uh, ba -do -ba -do. I just presumed. Hmm. Don't presume, man. Well, I don't know how I got here. Sorry, bud. I don't know how what to tell you. Well, I don't know what to tell you either, man. I can't keep anybody's voices straight at all. At all, at all, at all. At all, at all. 
Besides the old bees, uh, cranberries, oh, so delicious. Mm. I found my answer. Uh, no, I'm actually still lost. Just be patient. The answer will come to you in time. Hmm, cranberries. Wait, how? Like I said, the answer will come to you in time. Hmm, that's not an answer. Go now, Mr. Sylvanus. Your brother is waiting for you. Is he? Is he waiting with a gun? Or a knife to stick me in the back? Oh no. He figured out I stole his headphones. Oh no. He's going to stab me in the back. Like the little brat he is. Oh, I can't believe it. Unacceptable. These are actually my brother's headphones. Well, that I borrowed without asking. Hmm. Oh, Nicholas, there you are. Hiding by the tree. What do you have to say for yourself, Nicholas? I thought I killed you. You did. How are you alive? Okay, well, you never really killed me. See, I already changed voices. Do you know who Nicholas is? Uh, not anymore. Okay, then. Uh, what am I supposed to answer? Nothing. I just think it's time I tell you who he is. I'm getting tired of, um, hesit- blah, blah, blah. Tired of hesitating and prolonging this. Who is he, then? Do you know the old geezer and that one guy? Yeah? Me, you, and them, we're all part of something. That sounds a bit pretentious. Yeah, it does. But regardless, we are each part of the sum total. What is the sum total? I am not entirely Nicholas Sylvanus. Hmm? We are Nicholas Sylvanus. Ooh, so we're all. So do we kill ourselves? Do we shoot ourselves in the brains then? Oh, and I'm red. Interesting. Do the colors matter? Is there is there something uh, something about the colors that I'm not getting? Red, orange, purple, blue. This is a bizarre game. An interesting experience though. Well made. Is this the end? Because I feel like I didn't get my questions answered. Oh, the old geezer is also Nicholas. He's just the one that wants cranberries. The other guy is just a cool one who doesn't think anything. Thanks for playing. Well, thank you for making this game, dev developer. I don't remember the name of the developer. I wish I did. I should write that down so I can actually say their name and stuff and, 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 and thank them for actually making it because I mean the people put a lot of work into these games and stuff and yeah just saying thank you uh, it, sometimes is enough but but I would like to also kind of um, actually thank them personally saying their name and stuff and, and thank them that way and stuff just a little bit more personal and stuff but that way I actually kind of know who's making the games and stuff or or at least the name that they put on on the page when they develop it and stuff because I'm not sure if it's always their real name or stuff whatever it probably isn't always this is interesting though, it was well made. Um, I really liked it. Uh, little interest, I still don't fully understand the story. Something about them all being the same person. So in the beginning, wrote something about wanting to shoot his brother, but he was his brother. So did he shoot himself, and then this is him dead or something like that? Figuring stuff out? I'm not quite sure. I didn't fully understand it. Maybe you guys understood what the symbolism and what the message if there is any real message what it is and stuff i think my camera might have frozen and while, while i was talking there okay just in case my camera froze i'll, I'll repeat myself a little bit um like i was just saying if, if you guys understood kind of what the message is because i didn't fully understand what was going on besides um that you might have shot yourself or something like that 
and, and something like that. So if you guys understood what the message is, just please uh, um, go ahead and throw that in the comments and let me know because I'm a little curious of what happened. I just, I'm not quite sure what, what I get out of it is that he killed himself maybe and, uh, or shot himself, maybe didn't die. But uh, this is him figuring out, like, the other people were him, as they said. And he's just trying to figure out. Very interesting. A well-made game. Um, uh, a beautiful game. It's it just very interesting experience and stuff. It, it could have been a little bit more interesting. It was very slow-paced. But that was kind of the, the point of the game, too. Is a lot of times those slow-paced games are actually good the way they're paced and slowly and stuff this I, I maybe i missed a whole bunch of stuff too maybe there was more notes and stuff but it was it was really well constructed game and stuff um so thank you guys so much for watching if you liked it please feel free to leave a like or comment letting me know and um yeah, if you have any other games that uh, you think i should play just throw them down in the comments and i'll do my best to go ahead and play those if, if i can um i don't really have that much money so if i if i have to buy it that might not be um, I might not be able to play them and stuff but uh, free games for sure I'll, I'll take a look at them and, and try to play them but uh, thank you guys so much for watching let's do this again sometime what are you what are you with your floppy little legs oh my dear friend you are burnt to crisp he's in pain asking for you to help him um we will help him by murdering him. Mm, yes. <laughs>